Journal of Sergeant Lionel Williams. You'd think coming to such a little place like Santa Helena would be as blissful as a gentle ride in the Californian countryside. No such luck. Bandits and corrupt soldiers murdering and pillaging all that's good and decent in the world. Very few friends. All too many enemies. Although Napoleon is dead, his evil still lives on. It's times like this where I wonder if man or woman can possibly prevail over such... With bedtime stories like that, I'm amazed your daughter doesn't have nightmares. Do you mind? You're very bleak for a golden boy, you know that? Well, if you must know, I was just about to cover the subject of an irritating yet helpful friend of mine who might actually give this story the happy ending it deserves if she just tell all my friends to stop wasting time saying, Dear Diary, how true. Especially when Montoya is plotting to crash Don Philippe's stagecoach right this moment, killing him, his wife and children, reverting all his land and fortune to the state. What? When did you ambush is happening at Cloverly Way? Vamanos, odd man. Vamanos. Wait! I hate that kid sometimes. How does she know things before I do? Oh, that's the um, Queen of Swords, by the way. My partner, my friend, in the ongoing fight against crime, corruption, and Colonel Luis Montoya. All to save the people and bring peace to Santa Helena, California. This is her story, still ongoing. I'm just along for the ride. Why don't you join us? We need all the support we can get. As the kid says, vamanos! D.C. Wood, the author of Podio Book Nameless and novel The Saviour, Book One, continues the unfinished saga of a cult television series, Queen of Swords, with this unofficial podcast novel that spans across multiple story arcs and features the return of unforgettable characters as played by Tessie Santiago, Paulina Galvez and Peter Wingfield. Queen of Swords, Riding Towards Sunset, written and performed by D.C. Wood, Available now for free download from iTunes and podiobooks.com. One day, justice will finally be done.